It's Feedback Gaming. Welcome back to my peaceful Germany. We've just had an election in Kaiserreich, and we have the same ruler. Uh, of course, because he's the Kaiser, right? Yeah. <laughs> he's the same guy. Anyway, so we're going to try and repel some of these invasions. Looks like they've landed into the UK again. Uh, Commonwealth of Canada. Huh. Huh. Hold this area. Going to grab our tank divisions. Move them here. As long as they get a safe journey over, that'll be totally fine. Germany and the Italian Federation. With the Catholic of our as our new Kaiser, we embark on a new relation with the Italian Federation and the Catholic world in general. Cordial relation. Announce our support for the Pope. Support the Catholic Church and invest more in the Catholic Dominion regions of Kaiserreich. God damn, we're helping them out. Let's do it. We love the Pope. We love the Pope. Alright, that's good. We're gonna we're gonna go here and then we're just gonna grab Bit Bristol. That way they're they're cut off from another area again. Looks like the uh Indians have expanded again, which is a bit of a nuisance because that means there's a possibility they might become a major power again. Logging of Madagascar. The island of Madagascar has been under our rule for several decades and is an untapped source of rare timbers like ebony and several varieties of rosewood. Because of these sources are not being exploited, several industries and members of the colonial government have proposed we establish a joint stock company with the authority of the timber industry on the island. Shall we decree the establishment of this company? Hell yeah. Okay, this lot, that's, not, that's not working. We're going to have to go around the outside, around the outside. This is good news because we're reducing the amount of divisions for Canada. So when we land into the Canadian mainland, we'll have less of a problem engaging them. How's it going? So we shot down 15, they've shot down 16 of ours. Pretty even. Bombed eight buildings. Our bombings are going quite well. Uh, went for the rocketry, didn't we? We want to go for this one so we can work down to the bottom of the tree, but we don't have the ability to do that. Offer to Venezuela. Yeah, why not? Let's just see what some of these events do. I've never actually experienced them before. 3.6 million. We're on limited conscription too. We are insanely strong right now. There you go, there's our super new, most up-to-date strategic bomber. I'm gonna fit an engine. I think it's so important that we make the bombing better. Bombing and reliability. Where is it, it's here. Aluminium? No, we don't need that much. What the fuck? Oh, it's for French Kingdom. Oh, okay, okay, that's fine. Small victories, just taking chunks out of their navy. How many divisions has the Union of South Africa got? 23. Rocketry? Sure. Construction? Sure. Go for the final rockets. Go for the machine guns. We've got lots of naval experience. Do we have the final destroyers ready yet? Nope. We can research a light cruiser, couldn't we? I think we were planning to, but I just got sidetracked. 
And naval experience is just sitting there doing nothing. Oh, we don't have those planes there anymore. I wonder why. Iberian coast. Taking out more convoys. South Africa. Aircraft. Bella looks bombing us. Arabia. Ooh. Okay, that's interesting. There's quite a few enemy ships around here. These are the Japanese. I know they are. Alright. I want you to go back and repair. Managed to do full repairs. Yep. So we got a lot of convoys. South Rhodesia's fallen, which is good news. That means the uh, should have a gap in the middle, shouldn't we? Send a procurement expedition. I guess that's to try and find more oil, isn't it? Kind of curious to see what this event does regarding the Navy. The fall of Lisbon. Ha! Ah, Venezuelans say no. Despite our more generous offer, Venezuela has said no to us. Does that mean we can do the final one or is it just a straight no now in future? No. Okay. Venezuela is a land rich with untapped oil and stable government. Both make them great interest in us. Okay, whatever. Whatever. There you go. Go. And then the Navy is going to be on escort duty now. Perfect. Okay, well, it's kind of convenient that they've landed for me because uh, I don't have to plan my invasion now, so it's all good. Alright, everyone focus on here now. Air supremacy. And you're dead. Are they going to fight some more? Looks like they are. 90% unity, damn. I'm not going to survive for much longer though. Divisions. 15 to 27, what? Well, oh, the British Empire's taken control of this. Okay, whatever. Oh man, when you look at the damaged factories, you're like, eh, did I even make that much of a difference? I guess I damaged the infrastructure quite badly. It's five of seven, I guess that's not too bad. Where are they bombing me from? Is it from here? Be from Malta as well, couldn't it? All right, we don't need those anti-air. We don't really need to focus on those anymore. I'm having trouble with artillery as well. 
The Kaiser Marine stands as the strongest navy in the world in the year 1936, but many challenges will face it in the coming years. The expanded Empire of Japan and the resurgent Commune of France both have the key future enemies to un unseat the German naval supremacy across the world. In 1934, we have begun a large naval construction plan, and the ships begun then are slowly being finished. However, with our naval industry still limited, we have a very limit. We have limited ourselves to one area of production. What should we focus on the next six months? Destroyers, whatever. <laughs> uh, convoys, ships. Okay, so let's think what we need to do now. Um, I'm really not sure where the bombers are from. Oh, the form of Beijing. Wow, oh no, that finally fell. Man, they held out for so long too. Mm, there's not really much I can send them either. Don't need as much close air support anymore. Making a lot of mechanized. Could send them some mechanized. It's quite a lot of mech then, isn't it? 1,500. That's enough to like make quite a few divisions. All right. So, oh, hello. One division on its own. So the push into Africa has been uh, pretty solid too. Any issues with supply? Supply is still good. We have a lot of damage factories. Tunis. Oh, they're all here. Um, I think we'll position a few of you guys here. Yep. Hold ports and also resume unrest. What? Here? Yep. You guys are attacking here. Yep. Okay. So let's think about Canada. What's our range like? Not too bad. It's going to be the classic Iceland strategy, is it? Might as well be. French Kingdom. That's my guy, isn't it? Yep. I'm not sure if this is true, but I've always assumed that if you try and if you build a bigger port, doesn't it give you more range? I'm not even sure if that's true. There's a big port here, isn't there? Yeah. You know what we'll do? We'll maneuver our fleet here, and then we'll go patrol here. Oh, we could grab this one as well. And they're trying to land here anyway. That's good. <clears throat> we'll go for Nordstrom. That means uh, Germany has proposed a deal to the Cubans. Okay. I think what we'll do is try and grab these islands. Then we can grab some Caribbean. And then we can move further up. I think that's what we'll do. To be honest with you, we really should have switched out the artillery now, shouldn't we? Can we do that now? Yeah, let's just do that now. And that gives us lots of artillery too. A thousand pieces of artillery, so we could give that to you, couldn't we? This is going to reset the timer, but it doesn't matter. 459. I'm here with 127, 28. Once, once, go. Uh, cancel the artillery now, we don't need it.
Canadian Commonwealth is called the French Republic and the enemy of the French-German War. Ah! So they have joined the Entente. We don't actually board them at the moment. So we don't actually have a way to attack them. <laughs> okay, interesting. Um, hmm. There's a big air base there, isn't there? How's the bombing going? Bombed nothing. A thousand of them. Let's make lots and lots of bombers. Really, those carriers. Move those to the top. We should shift these further down because we don't need mech in our armor as much as we did before. There we go. Let's Krieg. Camper Froppen. Alright, so I think what we'll do is low in land into here. Oh, these are our guys, aren't they? Oh, they are, but they are uh, they're cut off, aren't they? Yeah. Um, we need landing craft. All right, so we're the major powers again now. So we're gonna have to take out Russia, aren't we? Um, do, 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 do. The Russian Republic. Yes. Secure Georgia can annex the Socialist Republic of Georgia. None of these are worthwhile. IG Farben. Hmm. Squad tactics, sure. After the promise of getting their economy jump-started with German investment, the Cossacks have agreed fully. What does that even do for us, though? German economic support. Oh, of course, we've got the uh, the Russians in uh, Scotland. Okay, so that's important. We need to take care of that immediately. We all arrived? Yep. Let's go here. There's a lot of French uh, Russian divisions, isn't there? Ideology has grown. Yep. Need to go for support of Einstein and Miner. Recovery rate organization. Artillery is cheaper. The 10% guy is really strong. Oh, then again, the 10% attack and defense for armor is pretty good too. Yeah, we'll go for that. Actually, patrol, and we can engage those Russians. Need to be aware of this landing area as well. That could be a, a later problem. Alright, I'm gonna go here, 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 here. Where's our navy at the moment? Oh, it's. It's fighting in the, the other area, isn't it? Um, Time 
Northern China again. Still lost Beijing though, they've not gotten it back. Go here. Go here. Go here, then here, then here. Here, here, here. Man, swallowing up those divisions feels so good. Left a lot of divisions behind too. The Irish German business venture, represented from the Irish government, has approached us. Apparently, the Irish attempted to catch up with the rest of the civilized world and has taken an interest in opening a foreign industrial branch in one of our colonies, Morocco. The Irish have interest in our, in our nation's core cool oil reserves, which are currently have haven't made much of an effort to exploit ourselves. In exchange for rights to export the resources back to our nation, the Irish have proposed to pay us a share of the profits. Sure. Let them rot. What? Go here, 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 go here. Okay. So Scotland's been liberated. What other areas have we got to worry about? We've got here and here, which are part of Russia as well. <clears throat> We're still getting bombed, and I have no idea where the bombing is from, though. Let's have a look at the size of the Russian Navy. I can't imagine it's that strong. In fact, their army size isn't that big, to be honest with you. Hmm... Taking that. Oh, Portugal owns it. Okay. You guys can come back now. Alright, launch your attack. End this. Be aggressive for a second, then go back to normal. Union of South Africa's gone. Oh wow, they fell easy. They must have a, a, oh they had fifty percent unity. That's why. Elections in Italy. Excess civilian production. Wow. They're all maxed. Have no connection to Ruthia. It's a shame because there's no way we can connect with them again. Mm. Yeah, Russia isn't that strong. I think it's uh I think it's definitely winnable there, isn't it? Hmm. Oh the Russians have landed again. Oh Russians have landed here. Are these Russians? French Republic, Portugal, because they're part of the Entente, they're just going with the flow, aren't they? Uh, okay, let me bring you guys back now. <clears throat> Logging in Madagascar has been expanded. The joint company that has established that began to show some results in our inventory and rare timber are steadily raised. However, with a mechanism of logging that has put several thousands of people out of work, the joint stock company has at the same time advised to begin construction on a timber processing plant to streamline the production of timber products. If we were to fund the new product, it would kill two birds with one stone. Yeah, hell yeah, why not? Pacific States of America and the United Mexican States have signed a peace deal. Oh, they've beaten up the Mexicans. Interesting. 
That's so strange because look, they've got like twice as Mexico's got twice as many divisions than them. Okay, upgrade those rockets, that's good. Mechanizer being worked on. Don't really know where we can focus our production right now. I guess we could just do that. Just so we're putting our production somewhere. Hmm. Okay, so we need to launch an invasion of Canada. Uh, we were going to do it through here, weren't we? So let's just do that now. Let's bring our guys down to here. Ah, do we need rockets? Probably not. Let's just go for the infantry equipment. Egyptians demand the Suez. Let them have it on Eggy 36B. Early in the morning, our ambassador within Cairo has received a telegram from the Sultan demanding the return of the Suez into the control to return that will allow them ships to transverse the canal. Yeah, let them have it. And it hasn't given them back. I think that event... Oh, no, there we go. It's given them back. Remember, guys, we're going for the peaceful options, remember. We are peaceful Germany at the end of the day, even though it might not appear that way. You, you, you. The renewing of the 1934 naval program. I actually have no idea what this actually does. Well, I began a large naval construction plan. Began the construction. Blah, 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 blah. I actually do not know what it does. And it doesn't tell me what it does. So I have no clue. It doesn't actually say. And it doesn't actually give me any kind of buff either. So I have no idea what it even does. Got him. Alright, I think initially we'll go for the little island and then we'll move up. But the national focus is too. I guess we could focus on air production. 10% cheaper strategics is pretty good. Making one a day. I realize too that we should be focusing on these ones, assembly line, because our production cap's almost maxed. And a lot of our production... Uh, yeah, yeah, quite a few. Do I have to arrange for that? Really? Really surprised me, actually. Turn the mission off because we don't need to do that anymore. Uh, focus on those guys. One enemy ship there. Five enemy ships there. Okay, so they are fighting the Japanese right now. Hmm. As if we're having trouble with supply here. What the hell? I'm I'm really actually quite surprised. Because I thought we built this area up already. I like this there's a ten port here. It doesn't matter, we'll we'll build it up some more. North Sea conflict. One Cuban ship. Okay, we've got war on wars on one page now, which is yeah, it's kind of good. Empire of Japan is dominating Africa, uh, Africa Pacific, Indonesia, Malaysia is demolished, and looks like Australia is taking a hit as well now. I'd send you guns, but you're at war with me right now. Hmm.
<clears throat> I know I mentioned this before, and I'm not actually sure if it's true, but do these stack? I don't even know, but we're going for it anyway. With the excess PP, I, this seems stupid not to. Ah, uh, should we rush that one? Why not? Go. Hang on, do we own this one already? Yeah, we do, British Empire. Oh, great, glorious invasion. That uh, means pretty much nothing because we've already landed anyway. Yes. Oh, actually, what we could do is land um, here and then just... No, oh, no, we can't. Well, let us. Stop. Go here. And then go here. Yeah, there we go. And I just want to push Drake's towards Georgetown, which is the capital of the uh, Federation. A new timber processing complex has opened, and effects on the local economy we felt instantly. Workers who built the complex continued the work for the company, and many new workers are needed after construction was complete. The access to rare timbers has increased, and the gain, uh, the Gaia, was held in the Transnarive to toast the new complex's opening. Three civilian factories? Damn! Madagascar. Oh my god, that economy is booming. There's a lot of little role-playing elements, those, you know, those little, uh, little event chains that fire. That's it, we're occupying everyone, that's good. Chief of the Army, we can get another guy. Defense, attrition reduction, defense. Mechanize and motorize, speed, extra attack and breakthrough, that feels awesome, why not? Unless there's a better guy that I just missed. No. Another four days, then we're good to go. So because I've not played the German Empire before in Kaiserreich, I'm not familiar with a lot of the events and what direction they kind of went. So probably a few of you guys are probably a little bit upset that I've gone for options that have... Uh, um, I've gone for options that have resulted in war, but I wasn't aware they resulted in war, so I was completely none the wiser, so... Forgive me. Alright, that's done. Go for the rockets. No, not you. The other one. Alright. That. You guys are gonna go now? Yep. So we're gonna land here. And then we're gonna initially straight away push towards Georgetown, and I think we shouldn't have any problems. Supply is going to be a little bit iffy to begin with, but after that, I think it'll be okay. You know what? I haven't checked in a while. The production of self-propelled artillery. Yeah, we're converting tons of light tanks. Let's have a little cheeky look at one of these divisions. Yeah, it's a combination of old and new artillery. And we've arrived. Go, go, go. Speed's probably dreadful. Oh, social conservatives! No! Oops. How many divisions has Austria sent me now? I feel like I've clicked that button like four or five times now. Alright, this is just to pin them in. I actually don't think they'll make any gains, but... There we go. We're in position now. Oh my god, they're actually winning as well. Got them. Push them into the jungles. Okay, Mexico's declared war on... Uh, Mexico's declared war on the Pacific States again. Hmm. And that's it, I think. I'm sure they tried to land on top of me again. And now they're dead. Done. 
All right. And we're having a problem with supply here. Is there a possibility we can ask for control? Or... Yeah, they have. And here. And here. Yep. Actually, don't do that. Just go here. And then... Launch an invasion for you? Are we at war with you? No. We're going to have to go for Cuba. I think we'll try and go here. Actually, no, we'll go here. It's going to be tricky because there's a lot of... Uh, one, two... Oh, no, I think we can do this in two. Yeah, we can. The Kikuyu land has declared war on the Middle Africa. <laughs> what? Who the hell are you? Okay. We've got divisions down here. Luckily, just in the right place to do this. Take care of matters like this. The renewal of the naval program. I'm confused. Is it spawning ships for me? Is it like spawning ship free ships? Is that what it is? Is that what it's doing? It is. It's spawning free crappy ships that I don't even want. Well, I guess this is an interesting event. It gives you like lots of freebies and stuff. I suppose that's a bit different, isn't it? Oh my god, look how much we're getting from trade. 59. What's our main export? Oh, don't need that. Our main export. We're getting a lot from oil. Oh my god, so much from rubber. And also quite a lot from steel too. A very short-lived republic. And they're gone. Hang on a second, who's took this? I don't care, just let, let them the guys sort that out. Uganda's an independent... Oh, I don't even get it. On Kenya as well. And this nation too. Hang on a minute, they've pieced them out! Why don't you take all their land? Oh my god. <laughs> what is this? Enemies of enemies. Oh no, that's not good. It gives me the impression of a crash is incoming. Okay. Um, you guys go here. Guys, if you've enjoyed this episode, remember to like and subscribe. Drop us a comment below. We are going to launch our attack into the Caribbean now. Um, and then maybe launch an attack to Bermuda. And then into Canada. And I'm pretty certain we should be able to beat up Canada with ease. And then Russia, on the other hand, is going to be an interesting one. Are we going to... I don't know how we're going to do this. Are we going to somehow... Because if we fight with against Japan here, we're going to weaken Japan in the west and east. I guess we're going to have to try and land on top into the Arctic. Hmm. Anyway, I hope you have a good day, everyone. I'll see you guys soon. Bye-bye.